Okay, today I'm gonna talk to y'all maybe a little bit about goals. You know, it's very important, I think, to have some goals in your life here on Earth. This life on Earth, you know. I've had someone the other day tell me, you only get, oh, this is my only life I'm gonna ever have, so what am I gonna, I should be doing something else, you know, than what I'm doing now, I'm not very happy. This person was telling me, and I was thinking, I missed my opportunity actually to tell him about Jesus and stuff, but, uh, cause he said, this is my only life I'm ever gonna have, what am I gonna do, I mean, what am I, I need to be doing something better than what I'm doing now. But, <laughs> I don't know, I missed my chance, I guess, but uh, I thought this ain't the only life you're gonna have. There's a life after this. This is just the beginning. This is a, this is a little uh, raindrop, you know, of the ocean compared to what we're gonna have later. We're gonna be living Eternally, eternally forever you know it's for eternal it's uh so that's why you know you want to have some goals there on earth so you can uh go to a good place <laughs> afterwards you know if uh all you got on your mind is uh All you got on your mind is, uh, it's hard to explain, you know, uh, this is all you got. This ain't all you got on earth here. If this is all you think you got, then, uh, you're, you're in big trouble later. You need to get, you need to get your head straight, figure out what you're going to be doing, because this ain't all there is. It's hard to tell anybody that because they see too much other stuff on TV and different places like that. It's pretty sad, really. So, you know, when, uh, <laughs> I was just going to make this video about a goal, making goals for, uh, to have, uh, goals in your life so you can uh, it just makes it feel better if you have something you're working towards you know if you're out there just working and paying your bills and your goal is only for getting drunk on the weekend and that's what you're living your life for for a Friday night Saturday night partying I mean how long can you do that I mean is it really that what you want to, I guess that's what you want to leave your legacy saying, man, that guy, he really liked the park. Uh, you remember back when, uh, what's his face worked all weekend so he could party, I mean, worked all week so he could party all weekend. <laughs> I mean, is that what you want to leave behind? Is that all you want to, is that all you want out of your life? I got this little lawn care business, but I used to be a truck driver. I drove dump trucks, big trucks, little trucks, long trucks, short trucks. It's about any kind of truck you got out there, I drove them. <laughs> uh, but uh, I'm not uh, wanted to be a truck driver all my life, and maybe get a little bit out of shape and I'm trying to get back in the shape do better for my body cause just uh enjoy myself while I'm here on earth before I go to paradise <laughs> no, I do believe there is a life after death and we're gonna have it's gonna be amazing and if you ain't thinking that I don't know what you're thinking cause 
if this is it, it ain't much, is it? If this is all we're living for, it ain't much. That's what I say, it ain't very much. If this is it, it ain't much at all, really. So, and if it ain't it, and this is it, it is it. But, just think if there is, if you're wrong, and this ain't all there is, and then you didn't live right, and you didn't, you don't get to go to paradise, you know? What, that would be horrible. You have to spend your life in misery, the rest of it. Eternity, misery. It's too late, once you die, to, to make it right. You need to do it now. Really, you need to do it right now. But, you need to find a good preacher to talk to, or just a good friend that you know who goes to church somewhere. You know you got friends out there that go to church and, and they live a different life than some of the other people that that are on that listen to this. So <laughs> I don't want to make this about church and everything, but it just slipped into that position that that uh slipped into that conversation. So what this is mainly is you need to have goals. Set some goals and try to make them goals and if you don't make them you gotta postpone your date like you know I got goals uh, have a certain amount of money in the bank at a, at a certain time you know I don't always hit them goals and very seldom do I hit them goals you know but I got goals uh, every week try to get so many so much of my work done but I've been pretty good about that because I try not to make too much work but I I've got plenty of work though, I, and it's it's a uh, it's been real interesting just trying to do my own business. But uh, you know, I just like to uh, have my uh, goals in life. You know, try to make a plan. You got to make a plan. Plan your out your goals, plan out your life. If you don't have a plan. It makes it really hard. <laughs> if you don't have a plan, it's hard to have goals. If you don't have goals, you need a plan. Without a plan, you can't have any goals. But I just have a. I'm not an expert on all this stuff. I just thought I'd share my opinion. You know, you don't want to be no. You want to, I'm gonna leave something behind for my kids to have. You know, but, and it's something to remember me. They all might remember me as that that I worked all the time. You know, and I want to be able to do something fun every now and then too with with my kids and stuff. My kids are all growing up pretty much. They're in their twenties getting close to 30, you get one or two of them there, making you feel old when your kids are getting close to 30, <laughs> but that's why life's short, this life on earth is really short, so you want to enjoy yourself, and you want to, you know, and uh, you want to work and get paid for your time, I only got so much time on this earth, and I uh, hopefully he's people out there some of them really appreciate what I'm doing because I give them a pretty good deal in their yards some of them and uh that's my time I'll never get back working on these people's yards I'll never get that time back but that's why I need to get some money for when I do it I have one lady she didn't pay me my money and she's moving out she moved on I lost money last year and I gave her a second chance and I'm losing money on her again this year. I'm going to call her in a little bit too after I make this announcement. Alright. That's about, I'm getting a little, get off that subject because that really burns me when people don't pay me when I do, when I work. <laughs> that almost makes me want to make everybody pay in advance. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this up here pretty quick. I only got about uh, two minutes to finish what I got to say. And all I was wanting to say is make you some goals. 
And if you don't meet your goals, just stretch out the time period a little bit, or you can change your goals even. Make them easier. Make your goals easy at the beginning and get easier and easier. And, uh, you know, that way you can get your stuff done. You don't want to make your goals so hard that you're never going to accomplish them. So, anyway, uh, get you some goals, get your right, your head straight, so we can party and see each other in heaven, you know, you don't want to be, uh, half your friends in the bad place whenever you pass on and you think, oh man, I should have listened to, listened to them, I guess they were right, this sucks, but it's over then, there ain't no second chance, so, uh, Figure out what you want to do with your life. Make you some goals. And remember that life is really, really, really short. Life is so short. You don't want to waste waste it by just doing something that, you're, that ain't good for you. So anyway, I hope you guys got a little something out of this. And if you like my channel, you can like and subscribe. And tell me what you think about this video. I've never done one where I talk about stuff other than what is showing on the camera. So uh, let me know if you like this video. And like and subscribe, please. And uh, there's going to be a giveaway. After I get a thousand subscribers, I'm going to give away a $100 Harbor Freight card. Gift card. 